Well, hello everyone. Thank you for being here, Poncho. We'll begin here in about one minute, so be ready. Give a little bit of time for the rest to connect. Hello, Lily. Hello, Mr. Hi. How are you? Everything good? Yes, I couldn't be better. All right, great, great. Mm -hmm. What about you? I'm doing great. I'm doing great. I was watching a little bit of TV earlier and just for about maybe 10 minutes. But overall, I've been busy with, you know, with some of the with administration, with you and some of the people here to make sure everything's working good. Anyone needs help, right? I called them, tried to help them also, right? A few students and for my other classes also. So I've been very busy. Okay, I got it. It's much yeah. better to yeah. be easy. Yeah. Yes. yes, it's much better for me, right? Than to just be doing nothing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Let me see. We'll begin here in a few seconds. I have to just make a few announcements. Let me see. Give me a second, please. I need to take off my closet. Okay, no problem. Okay, no thank problem. you. Okay. Let me see. Okay, we'll begin here in a few seconds, so be ready. Hello, Maria Jose, Amilka, Evelyn. Uh, good evening, everybody. Hi, hi, welcome, welcome. Michelle, Ailey, and Judy, Del Carmen. Lily, Veronica, Areli, Diego, and Dina. Hello, teacher. Hi, welcome, welcome. Thank you for being here in the conference. Okay, class, let me see. What is today's date? I'm going to have a today's date. Go ahead, Wednesday. Amilcar. Okay, Dina, go ahead, Dina. <laughs> Wednesday, July 21. 2001? Mm -hmm. 21. Okay. 21. <laughs> Close. Sorry. Almost. Okay, almost. Okay, Dina, thank you. Okay, Judy. It is Wednesday, 21st July 2021. Mm, okay. Close. Maria Jose, thank you. Uh, today's date is Wednesday, July 21st, 2021. Very good. Very good. Can you repeat it, please, for the class? What do you want to say? Just the sentences I said at the beginning. Yes, the date. Can you repeat it for the class? Because you did it. You did it great. Uh, today's date is Wednesday, July 21st. 2021. Very good. Very good. Okay. So I hope mm -hmm. that was heard. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very good. Amilcar. Today is Wednesday. 21. 2021. Okay. Close. Cerca. Let me see. Lily. Okay. Today is Wednesday, 21st, July, 2021. Okay, close. Okay, close. Cassie, right? Okay, let me see. Michelle Carranza. Today is Wednesday, July, 21st, uh, 2021. <laughs> very good, very good. Yes, very good, very good. Yes. Roberto Guevara. Wednesday, July 21st, 2021. Very good, very good, very good. Eric Fernandez. Yes, sir. Hi, Wednesday, welcome. Wednesday, July 21st, 
2021. Mm, okay. Almost. Casi. Let me see. Maria Susena. Yes. The date, please. Ah, okay. Today is Wednesday, Wednesday 21 July 2021. Okay. Ah. Close. <laughs> Close. Okay. okay, very good. Thank you for your effort. Majori. Oh. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay, great. Hi. Good evening. Uh, today is Wednesday, July 21, 2021. Mm -hmm. Okay, close. Casi. Very good, very good. <laughs> Milagro, thank you for participating. Milagro. Hello. Today's date, please. Today is Wednesday of July of 21, 2021. Okay, close, close. Let me see. Romulo. Edgar. Hello. Hi, Edgar. Hi, how are you? I'm doing great. Can you give us today's date, please? Uh, Wednesday, July 21st, 2021. Very good, very good, excellent. Now, I'm going to share screen with you. Remember that we are using ordinal numbers. Ordinal numbers when we say the date. Cuando decimos la fecha, utilizamos números ordinales. We use ordinal number, not 21, not two, not three, not four. Esos son números cardinales, cardinal numbers, okay? When we okay. talk about date, we say ordinal numbers. Remember that there is a difference between ordinal numbers and cardinal mm -hmm. numbers, right? Cardinal numbers are one, two, three, four, five, 20, 21. Uh, those are cardinal numbers. Ordinal numbers first. Second, third, 22nd, 21st, 23rd. Okay, remember that the cardinal, the ordinal number is only the last digit. El último dígito es el que se pronuncia ordinal. Okay, you only pronounce the last digit, the last number, or the last digit in ordinal form. So you say 21st, okay? Remember okay. that, okay? So tomorrow is going to be 22nd, okay? Remember, there are only four pronunciations. No más hay cuatro en el sistema de inglés. There are only four pronunciations First. in ordinal form. I hope, I hope, you know them, okay? Espero que ya sepan todos las cuatro, right? Is there anyone here? Que diga, teacher, yo realmente I don't know them, all right? If yes. no, what I can do is maybe... I, I don't know, teacher. Okay, very good. <laughs> all right? At least you're honest. Prefiero que sea honesto porque eso me da... Que les puedo dar tres que unos cinco minutos in here and there, right? To practice the ordinal numbers. Because it's, it's new yeah. for me. <laughs> new. It's new? Yeah. Yes. Oh, okay. Okay. So here, the only difference is, can you see this number here? Can you see it? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. If you yes. notice here, I have a ST. Right? So when you see this, it's not 21. Not 21. We say 21st. Yes, 21st. Okay, and there are only four sounds. Cuatro sonidos, only four sounds. The TH, the RD, the ST, and the ND. But I'm going to probably spend like five minutes oh, in yeah. another time to just disperse, right? <clears throat> disperse some of that knowledge to you so you can have a better understanding of the ordinal numbers and the pronunciation that is important. 
Okay, so today is okay. Wednesday. 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 Remember, Wednesday. 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 Primero viene el día. Wednesday. Then the month. Okay. Después el mes. July. Day Wednesday. July. 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 Day, July. July. 21st. 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 Right? Ahora el año si lo decimos regular. 2021. Or? 2021. Or? 2021. Yes, very good. 2021. 2021. Very good. So this is how you structureize the date. Now, if you ask me, if you ask me, teacher. Teacher, is this the only way? Okay, hay otra forma también, right? But this is the most basic one. This is the most basic one. This one is the one you should know. Es la que ya deberían saber, okay? If you don't, don't worry. I will guarantee you that by the end of this module, al final de este módulo, the ordinal numbers se lo van a aprender. All right? Because I'm going to have you practice every day. Okay. All right, so don't worry about it. Okay. okay. Now, if you say, for example, somebody mentioned off, I you mention know off, right? The 21st of July. Hoy es el 21 de julio. You can say it that way, the 21st of July, but you're adding another word. Ahí le están agregando otra palabra más. So you use this as the basic form, and you cannot go wrong. Right? You know this, sabiendo esta estructura, nunca se va a equivocar. Right? It will never go wrong. So remember. Okay, let's continue. Now, uh, Roberto, can you give me the topic, please? Can you read it? Moral verbs for requests and suggestions. Okay, Suge suggestions. Suggestions. Suggestion. Suggestions. All right, suggestions. Yeah, like yes, suggestion. yes, suggestions. Suggestions. Very good, Roberto. Suggestions. Yeah, con la S al final with the S. Suggestions. Suggestions. All right. All right, sugerencias. All right, suggestions. And you have mm -hmm. requests. Okay, so we're going to be looking at motor verbs. We're going to do a little bit more practice with what we saw yesterday too, because it's related, okay? Va como relacionado. It's a little bit related with the videos for today also. And I have a little extra practice. Now, if some of you, hello, Lily, you have a question? Yes, I have a question. What is the meaning of request? Which one? Request? Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. But like whenever you are requesting, está, like for example, it's almost the same as suggestions, but it's for request, como que está pidiendo una solicitud, all right? Remember what we saw yesterday when we said, oh, I broke my hand, what should I do? Que debo hacer? You're, you're requesting help. Está solicitando ayuda. And then the person gives a suggestion or, ¿cuál es la otra palabra? Advice. 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 Consejos, right? Advice. And then we talked about going to the hospital, right? Uh, different types of things for health. And we will continue with that topic today, Lily. Continuaremos okay. con eso hoy también. So, don't, so you will have uh, a little bit more practice. But thank you for asking, Lily. Thank you for asking. Okay, thank you. Now, I have to be clear, okay? Ya que está la mayoría aquí. I have to be clear. Okay. Remember, ayer les mencioné algo, right? Les dije, les sugerí que no los Exact, gracias, thank you very much. A veces me olvida some Spanish, some words in Spanish, and thank you for helping me, Tina. I advised you to stay away from lists que se queden lo más alejados de listas. ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? Ayer mandó una notificación a la administración, right? Al grupo. Ta, 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 que por favor, ten pendiente, cualquier... Today, I received, yo recibí la lista. 
¿ok? No es que yo puse aquí a ver quién, porque no, no puedo, ¿no? Right? But, I received that list. Les dije ayer, auditan las videoconferencias, right? So, they can see, ellos pueden ver, ah, ya lo mencionó el teacher, vamos a ver. Prr, aún siguen algunos que no, right? Lo bueno es que no eran muchos, right? It wasn't that many, right? Salieron más de mi otro grupo, right? But this group was like a little bit lower, right? So I'm happy for that, okay? Pero aún, remember que eso queda registrado, okay? So la lista no es que yo la saqué, no, right? It came from, vino de más arriba, right? So I had to put it on the group para hacer que eso notificara, okay? Ahora, depende de ustedes si cumple. Right? Now, por eso puse allí, administración verificará si ya cumplió, porque yo no puedo verificarlo. Ok, so por eso lo pongo así. Quizás se oye como wow, right? Pero así es, right? Remember, ayer les dije que las listas de espera son grandes. Ok, no vayan a permitir que alguien más ocupe su lugar. Ok, so una vez más, eso tiene que estar ya completo para mañana y para el martes, ¿qué tienen que tener ya completo? La tercera. La tercera y? El examen. El examen. Si <risa> no cumplen, el examen midterm, right? Si no cumplen para ese día, créame, me va a llegar otra lista. All right? y, y al final, yo pienso que ya no habría lista. <laughs> All right, so please don't, 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 don't waste, no, no, uh, no tienen a perder una oportunidad, okay? Please, okay. my suggestion to you. Y Thank si you, lo vuelvo, Si lo vuelvo a repetir, right? Porque Thank me preocupo you, por ustedes, me preocupo. Thank you. Right? So, I hope, I hope, yo deseo, yeah. espero, que para allá, cuando lleguemos al martes, que te digan, nadie se... Ya termine. Ya, right? que administración me diga, para usted no hay lista, Mr. Henry. Yo voy a decir, all right, <laughs> right? So I'm going to go in class, y le voy a explicar, hey, no, no, no. Right? <laughs> I did what they were supposed to do, great, right? Y así queda, all right? Okay, class, let's continue. I wanted to share that with you. Quería compartir y ser eh, franco con ustedes y honest. Right? Ser honesto con ustedes. All right. Thank Now, you. No problem. Mr. Amilcar. Hello. Oh. Okay, we are going to... Can you read this? What the topic of the, of the conversation is? Can you read that? Conversation. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Um, hi, may I help you? Okay, very good. Lily? Yes, please. Could you have something could, for the? Could I? Could I? Let me could help. I have? Let me Go ahead. Thank you. Right. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, Lily. Okay, okay. Yes, please. Could I have something for a cold? Cough. 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 Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> right? A tosita, right? Very good. Continue. I think I think I'm getting a cold. Very good. I think I'm getting a cold, right? A cold. Ooh. Right. All right. Continue, please. Thank you, Lily. Uh, Marjorie. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Very good. And yesterday I told y'all what were cough drops, right? Cough drops. Cough drops. Cough Very good. drops. Excellent. Okay, Roberto. Yeah. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Very good. Thank you. And where? Very good. Excellent. Let me see. Eric Fernandez. Hello. 
Okay. Can you continue? But, uh, yes, sir. Uh, uh, excuse me for my distress. Okay, no because problem. Because I coordinate the different uh, uh, activities for okay. my work. So. Okay, no problem. Okay, we were going, we were right here where it says, um, thank you, what do you suggest for dry skin? Uh, thank you. Thank you. And what do you suggest, suggest for dry skin? Suggest. Suggest for dry skin. Very good. Continue, Eric. Try some of the new lotion. It's very good. Okay. Try some of this. This new. New. A uh, new. Yes. New lotion. Very good. What is lotion? Uh, is the uh, perfume mm. lotion? Mm, yes, it's lotion, but uh, lotion. it's lotion. for dry skin. Dry skin. What is what is dry skin? Piel seca. Piel seca, right? So you're using lotion like um, aloe vera lotion mm. or um, what other type? Lubriderm. Hay diferentes marcas, right? And lotion that you put in your hand for dry skin. Para esa piel que está reseca, right? Dry skin. Body lotion. Yes, body lotion. That is correct. Very good. Continue, please. Um, thank you, Eric. Thank you. Mr. Henry. Yes? Uh, for here in Mexicanos, it's raining very hard, so I don't listen to you very well. You cannot listen? You cannot hear me? No me puedo escuchar, Amilcar? Can you hear me? Yes, because it's raining, it's raining ah. very hard. Okay. okay, no problem. Well, thank you for telling me, okay? Thank you for noticing. Okay, okay. Okay, no problem. Let me see. Um, let me select someone else. Let me see. Thank you. Michelle. Hey, can you continue, please? Mira, del grupo militar necesitan una foto. Okay. De... And one more thing, my husband has no energy this day. Can you suggest anything? Okay, days, days, days. <clears throat> very good. Okay, husband, husband. Husband. Yeah, husband, right? What is husband? Esposa? Esposa. Yeah, very good, right, yes. And one more thing he said, okay, one more thing, right, is what she said. This is web. One more thing. My husband has no energy, right? Has no energy these days. Can you suggest energy? So, ahí está pidiendo que... No tiene energy. Yes. So, he's asking for suggestion. Una sugerencia, right? Mm -hmm. Can. Notice here. El modo verb can. Can. Can you. Can you. Puede sugerirme algo? Right? And what does the pharmacist say? Let me see. Dina. Hi. Hi. Can you continue, please? His shoulder. Try some of these multivitamins. They're, they're excellent. Okay. They're excellent, right? They're excellent. Right. Multivitamins. 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 Uh, very good. With the S at the end. Con la S al final, right? Multivitamins. Multivitamins. All right. And that means. It's a Latin word. Multivitamins. Yes, that is correct. They're excellent, right? So he's, he's showing her some of these multivitamins. Let me see. Let me call on. Olga. Great. May I have three Great. large bottles, please? Very good. Right? So she's like, yeah, give me three, right? Not one. Give me three. Great. Excellent. Olga, good job, right? She she wants very energy for her husband. Yeah, she wants a lot of energy for her husband, right? Yeah, that is correct. That is correct, Roberto. That is correct. She wants some you want some strong and healthy, right? Multivitamins. So now, this is a lady asking for suggestions, right? 
So she's going to a pharmacist, to a pharmacy, and she's asking the pharmacist. Pharmacist, pharmacist, pronounce that. Yo sé que algo dura la palabra. Pharmacist. 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 Very good. Yes. Pharmacist. Pharmacist. Right? That is the person here, this guy right here, this man. He is the pharmacist. Pharmacist. Right? pharmacist. Anyone that works in a pharmacy is called a pharmacist. A pharmacist. Ese es el título de ellos en, in American language. A pharmacist. Right? He works at a pharmacy store. Let me see. Okay, let's okay, stop teacher, here. I, I have a question. Hello, Roberto. Uh, please uh, share the screen, please. Okay, no problem. Uh, it's possible to say, could you give me something for a cough? Yes. Okay. Yes, you can. Yes, yes, you can. Could I have something or could you give me something for a call? Oh, Very good. Okay, thanks. The, the difference here is, could I have, is could I have? 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 Algo para esta tos, right? The other way you say it is, puedes darme algo para esta gripe, right? So that is the only difference. It depends mm -hmm. on the concept. They're both correct, Roberto. All right. So it depends how you want to say it, but they're both correct. Okay. I have some okay. Thanks. Okay. Maria Jose, you have a question? Um, yeah. Could is another modal verb. Yes, could is another modal verb. That is correct. You have three here, Maria Jose. There are three here. No, we have four. Can, should, may, and okay, good. now could. Cool. But I'm saying at the be at the beginning of the sentence. Okay? At the beginning of the sentence when you start the question. Así lo vamos a ver ahorita. At the beginning of the sentence, right? May I help you? Could I have? And can you suggest? Right? I'm... Uh, yeah, you're correct. You have should here. I guess that should. Um, let me see. Suggest. Yeah. Right? Otra palabra de sugerencia. But at the beginning of the sentence, el modal verb, utilizándolo como okay. inicio. Okay? We have three. Okay? Can, could, and may. Okay? We're going to look at those. And that's all included. Todo va incluido en el paquete. Así como le dijo María José. We should, suggestions, advice, recommendations, anything of that nature that is related to the context is all accepted. But we are going to focus on how to use the modal verb at the beginning of the sentence. Okay? At the beginning of the sentence. Thank you, Maria Jose. You're very aware, paying attention. That is awesome. That is awesome. Very good. Let me see. Let me show you the video now of the. Let me see. Okay, so you can listen to it. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hi, ready to begin? In the conversation we're about to listen to, we will introduce modal verbs for suggestions and requests. Please practice the conversation with a classmate or a friend, as it is important to repeat for better understanding. Listen and practice. Hi, may I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. 
May I have three large bottles, please? <laughs> and she said large, right? The big ones, right? The big bottles of multivitamins, right? Okay, that was just so you can hear, so you can hear the conversation. And I saw some of you looking at it and practicing with your lips, which is great. Now, let's do the next part. Okay, let me turn off a microphone. Okay. Now, we're going to listen to the next one. As you can see here, motor verbs. There's three motor verbs. And motor verbs can, could, may. No, no way I let it, Joe. Let me see. Um, Diego, Arturo. Yes, teacher. Hi, can you read the topic, please? Okay. Modal verb can, call, may, or rescue, and suggest it. Suggestions. Suggestions. All right, I see al final. Suggestions. Suggestions. Okay, I'm todavía no estoy escuchando la S. Suggestions. Suggestion. Excellent. Very good. Very good, Diego. Excellent. So we have modal verbs can, could, may for request or suggestions. Suggestions, right? Let's look at this. Veamos. Can, could, may. Yes, can, could, may. Can, could, may. What I want you to do now is to write a sentence using each modal verb learned. Please write... Hello everyone, this time we will be introduced to the modal verbs can, could, may for suggestions and requests. Modal verbs can, could, may for requests. Suggestions. Can I help you? May I help you? Can I have a box of cough drops? Could I have something for a cough? May I have a bottle of aspirin? What do you suggest for dry skin? What do you have for dry skin? Try some of this lotion. I suggest some ointment. You should get some skin cream. In this case, can, could, and may are being used in question form to suggest or give advice. This is how we use them. Model verb plus subject plus verb have plus complement plus question mark. Can I have eye drops? May I have an ointment? Could I have some aspirins? What I want you to do now is to write a in question form to suggest or give advice. This is how we use them. Model Okay, as you can see here, right? What I have mentioned earlier, lo que mencioné temprano, what I mentioned earlier when we were reading, and I mentioned it to a classmate here, that we are using the modal verb in this instance at the beginning of the sentence, okay? To make it a question. Can someone read the structure, please. Let me see. Um, Roberto, you have your hand up, Roberto? You have your hand? Mira su mano ahí. Hello, Roberto Carlos? Okay. Roberto Carlos, hello? Okay, well. All right. Let me see. I think uh, connection problems. Maria Jose. Can you give me the structure, please? Um, model verb plus subject plus verb have plus complement plus uh, question mark. Very good, very good, okay? Excellent, question mark, question mark. Good. That is correct. So here we are using the model verb in question form in question for at the beginning of the sentence okay 
A esto me refería a María José cuando le dije temprano. A esto me refería a these three right here. All right. Y uh, Robert, yes? There's someone that is a teacher? No, señor Roberto. No, te, no lo oigo. Hello, Roberto Garcia. I cannot hear you good. ¿Alguien lo puede distinguir lo que está diciendo o soy yo? Tiene una pregunta, Dis. Ok. Yes. What is it? Tell me. Hello. ¿En qué momento puedo usar quién, me o tú? Whenever you're asking for. Ok, he asked when can I use it, ok, what we saw earlier, en la forma anterior, here. ¿Lo puede ver aquí? Hello? Can you hear me, Roberto? Ok. I, well, if you can see it, Roberto, here it is. More yes, teacher. Good. ¿Lo puede leer? Can you read it, please? Okay. Bye. Bueno, I cannot hear you. Um, but this is... Usted me pregunta, no. I'm going to turn off your microphone. I'm sorry. I'm not good, but I have to turn off your microphone. All right too much uh, interference, okay? So, but to answer the question, para el compañero, he asked me, how do you use, como se, se utiliza, how do you use them, right? Here it is, for requests, for requests. Now remember, this is just one way to use them, okay? He, he asked when, when use. Yeah, cuando se usa, when do you use it? Uh -huh. You use them for requests or suggestions, suggestions requests and suggestions. So in this instance, you are using it in that way por el tema que estamos viendo, okay? That doesn't mean, eso no significa que nomás sea esa forma, right? It can be used in possibilities, el can, for possibilities also, right? But in, this, sure. in this instance, we are using the modal verbs for request, and suggestions, okay? Uh, what, what do you mean request, teacher, please? Okay, let me see. What is request, All right? Cuando uno pide una solicitud. Sugerencia. Su solicitud o sugerencia. Okay, okay thank you. For example, you. Um, cuando uno está pidiendo, remember when I asked you yesterday, I broke my hand. Una recomendación. Una recomendación, una, un requisito que, que recomienda, una sugerencia. Those different ways to use these modal verbs. For this instance, ok? To make a request. Estoy haciendo un pedido. Por ejemplo, can I have a, a box of cough drops? For example, I can do this. May I have your name? May I have your last name? Amilcar? Excuse me, teacher. May I have your last name? Uh, my last name is uh, Alejandro. Okay, you see? ¿Qué es lo que pedí yo? Una solicitud que usted me diera su nombre. Apellido, right? May. May I have your... Estoy... Uh, okay. Uh, my last name is uh, Miranda. All right, Miranda. so... So I use, como pude ver, eh, como pudo ver, I'm using the example, may I have your last name, right? Estoy pidiendo una solicitud de usted, que usted me brinde eso, right? So it's may, or can. Can I, for example, I can say, Amilcar, can I have a glass of water? Uh, uh, cold or hot? A uh, Cold, please. Okay. okay. Um, um, eso se le llama okay. un request. That is what you call a request. Okay. All right. Here you are. All right. Very good. Very good. Here you are. So I'm requesting okay. something, right? <laughs> I'm, I'm requesting something. And okay. here we have, what do you suggest? 
buy some, y aquí ya son sugerencias también. What do you suggest? Uh -huh. right. Try some of this lotion. I suggest some ointment. What is ointment? Ointment. Oh, ointment. Huh? Oh, ointment. Oh, ointment. Right. Ointment. Una crema. Una crema or something. Right? Yeah, it's like a cream. Okay. Una crema, right? It's like a cream. <laughs> the medicina, right? <laughs> Medical ointment. Okay. Now. Let me go back here. Teacher. Okay, let me see. Okay. I want someone to read. I want someone to read. question form to suggest or give advice. This right. is how we use them. Okay. Now, I want someone to read, please. I think uh, Maria Jose already gave us the structure. Can someone read the first one, please? Majority. Can you read the first one, please? Hello? Okay, okay. Can I have eye drops? Eye drops, eye drops. Eye drops. Yeah. Very Can good. I have eye drops? Very good. Can I have eye drops, right? Eye drops, what are eye drops? Huh? Yeah, yes, eye drops, the ones you put in your eye, right? Ojo, at the ojo, right? <laughs> Next one, Lily. This one. Okay. May I have an ointment? Ointment. Come on. Ointment. 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 Yeah. Ointment. 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 Okay. Ointment. Very good. The last one, please. Um, let me see. Mr. Edgar. Could I have some aspirin? Very good. Good pronunciation. Excellent. Could I have some aspirins? Aspirins. Aspirina, right? Aspirins. So this is when you are suggest you are requesting something. Okay. You are requesting something. Right? You go to a farm and you say, um, could I have some some alcohol? Right? No, not drinking alcohol, right? I'm talking about alcohol for <laughs> for the pandemic, okay? <laughs> if you go to a pharmacy, right? A pharmacy. So here we're talking about terms of, like, for example, the ones we saw yesterday related to, ¿Cuál es el tema que hemos estado viendo? Can somebody give me the main topic? What are barriers for requests and suggestions? Okay, very good. And that covers what topic? The main topic. What sería? One word. Health. Excellent. Health. Health, right? La salud. Remember, salud, health. Okay, so that is our focus. Okay, that is our focus with this usage. We're all related to like, hey, otra vez aspirinas and stuff like that. Yeah, we're talking about health. Health. Let me see. Okay. Now. Health. Health. Yes. La salud. Did you have problem with my connection? Okay. I'm going to share with you the the next part. Remember this from yesterday? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So it's like, what do you suggest, right? What do you suggest? What do you suggest? We saw that yesterday. We saw that yesterday, right? Now, I want you to remember that. I'm going to put it back. And I want you to, to think about what you just saw. Imagine, imagine yourself that you are in a pharmacy. Imagine you're at a pharmacy. Imagínense la conversación que vimos temprano. Imagine that. Remember, who was it? A lady, right? She was buying what? What was she trying to buy? Different things, right? Different things. Y quizá la última que se va a recordar va a ser la multivitamins, right? 
Oh, multivitamin. Yeah, the multivitamin. Oh, lotion. Lotion. Okay, very good. So, um, dry skin. Dry, for dry skin, right? Oh, very good. Yes. That was the problem, right? That was the problem. So she had one of these problems. She had cold. dry skin, right? Cold, right? A cough. A cough. Right? So, yeah, como que ya, okay, yeah, we saw some of that. So let me ask you this. If I tell you, okay, I would like for you to get in groups and someone, que sea el, el pharmacist and the client. All right. So, for example, um, Majori, ya que tiene el micrófono activado, you are the <laughs> client, okay? I am the okay. pharmacist, okay? You come okay. into the pharmacy. Imagine, imagine, yo sé que todos aquí han ido a una farmacia, all right? Imagine going to the pharmacy, right? And you see me, right? I saw you. Right? I'm all in white with my name tag aquí, Mr. Henry, right? I'm the pharmacist of the store. And you are coming in to buy something or to get some medicine. And I tell okay, you, uh, hello, major. I no la conozco. I say, good, good afternoon, <laughs> good morning, right? Good evening, right? Uh, may I help you? Uh, yes, good, good afternoon. Uh, uh, I, I, I can help me. I need a I need a medicine uh, for a rush. Okay. Now, para iniciar, da el problema. Así como ella mencionó que el, el esposo was her husband was uh, no strength. He was a little bit weak, right? So you can say, I have I have a head a head. Uh -huh. I... <laughs> Head again. Ah. Headache. No, no. Headache. 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 Okay, very good. Headache. Headache. I have a headache. Okay, so you can I Tylenols? Okay. Tylenols. Tylenols, right? Tylenols. Tylenols. This, this is American. This is American uh, medicine, right? Can I have? Yes. So you come in and say, oh, good afternoon, welcome, come in, right? And you do the greeting. I have a headache. Can I have some Tylenols? Hey, I feel dizzy. I feel dizzy. May I sit down, right? May I sit down? Are you making a request? And I can say, well, sure, here are some Tylenols. And I suggest, right? Ya como para, ya doy mi sugerencia, my suggestion. I suggest you you take two of these or three Tylenols a day for seven days. I suggest you take three Tylenols a day for seven days. Or I suggest you buy these uh, this new headache pills, right? And a nueva versión or a new whatever, whatever you want, right? I suggest you buy these aspirins, Advils, diferentes marcas, Advils, for your headache. You only need to take one a day. And then you say, okay, thank you, all right? Alguien más que quiera participar and try to do this back and forth? Thank you, Majori. Amilcar. Okay, no, él tiene conexión mala ahorita, dijo. Eric. Hello, Eric. Yes, sir. Okay, can you select? Puedes seleccionar. Can you select a classmate, please? So you can do this together. One is going to be the pharmacist, and one is going to be uh, asking for, for the medicine or the re or requesting medicine. I choose to whoever you want in the group. Just a keep it A milker, sir. Okay, his connection. Then, Él me dijo que la conexión no está muy buena. His okay. connection is that too good because of the rain. So select someone else. In this case, Roberto. Okay. And Mark. Which one? 
Like there are two Roberts. Yeah, Robert. Yeah. Pero hay dos. Which one? Uh, Robert Adonai. Okay, Adonai. Okay. Very good. Okay. Begin. Who's going to be the pharmacist? ¿Quién va a ser el pharmacist? Uh, uh, Roberto Adonai. Okay. The customer Marjorie. Okay, no, usted va a participar, Eric. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, you are going to be two. You and Roberto, okay? All right, go ahead. Uh, he's like, no, A I am. I know you, you, okay. Go ahead. Go ahead, uh, Eric. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. This, uh, good evening. I... Good evening. May I help you? Uh, you can choose yes. any of these. Excuse me. I need to. Mm, I have. Uh, no, you know? I have. I have. I have a, a rash. A rash, okay. Very good. Mm -hmm. Continue for Eric. I uh, have a rash. Y luego va a ser el request. La solicitud uh, de lo que va a querer. The request. Can I have some medicine? Okay. Yes. Uh, I have, I have, I suggest this ointment Very and, you, and you put uh, twice a day. Okay, for how many days? For cuántos días? How many days? Uh, twice, a, twice a day for five days, five days. Very good, excellent, all right. And then Eric? Uh, in, uh, thank you, right? Or uh, Thank you, could, uh, could you please give me the, the medicine? <laughs> okay, very good, excellent. You see, it's just practice, okay? It's just speaking, ustedes solos, desarrollense, evolution, right? Evolutionize yourself, evolutionize yourself, all right? Imagine you're going to a pharmacist. Mm -hmm. right? But I have a question. All right, you can, you can mm -hmm. use these and then make your own, make your own ideas for you to carry, yes? Evelyn? Yes, Lily? Okay, Lily. Este, y no tiene, discúlpeme que me voy a acercar al teléfono bien cerca porque está lloviendo bien fuerte. Pero okay. mi pregunta es, es si no tiene infrastructura de grupo de conversación. The what? Group de conversation. Conversation groups. Mm, I, I'm not aware of that. We do it in class. We do it in class. But you can, you can, pueden ustedes, you can create your WhatsApp group y ahí pueden estar conversating also. You can be conversating there. For example, uh, Lily, you can ask some of your classmates here or in the group if you want to make an extra group so you can conversate amongst yourself, right? And through ustedes, you can. You can do that, right? Or you can communicate with them in that way. Okay, let me see. Okay, thank you. Okay, no problem. Evolution. Yeah, yeah, evolution, right? Evolutionize. Evolutionize yeah. it, right? So you have to be a, always try to communicate yourself in English and try to use it as much as possible, right? I understand we live in an environment where we speak Spanish and it's good, okay? You can do a little bit of Spanish here and there, but try to to surpass surpass your levels of English, all right, by practicing more. If you want, yeah, you can you can communicate here and you can talk with them and ask them if they want to maybe do some activities mm. outside or practice outside the class, you can. Okay, but thank you, Eric and Roberto, for, for practicing here. I'm going to put you in breakout rooms. Thank you for, for giving the example, all right? Any questions? Remember, one is going to be the pharmacist, and now I'm going to I'm going to show you this. Si le quieren tomar captura, you can. You have this one already, right? You have this one, and you have this one. If you can take a picture of it, okay, you can take a picture and 
you have access you have access to share screen okay Edgar I didn't forget okay okay so I didn't forget from yesterday what you said so I I already activated that in the application so you can share screen okay 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 so let's practice I'm going to put you in breakout rooms and speaking time I want you to practice what you learned put it to use if you have a question please feel free to press the button let me see okay create you can practice I'm going to put you in three so you can uh, so you can continue to practice all right one two You ask for help? Yes, yes, teacher. Uh, I, I don't have a, a, the picture. What, where is the picture? Okay, that one. Okay. That one, and then you have to, you have to ask. Remember, lo que puse en la pantalla ahorita, le dije que se podían tomar capas. Ajá, sí, nos dijo, pero, pero no la compartió. <laughs> no, era ustedes que le tomaran la captura. Y así Ajá. ustedes pueden compartirla. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. I, 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 I can yes. Okay, but see if you don't have it. Okay, so you know. Ya ahorita ya, ya le tomé ya le tomé captura. A verla. Can I see it? Okay. Mamá me dice que no puedo porque usted el participante está compartiendo la suya. Sí, no es que yeah es uh, María Susana. A ver, you have. ¿Usted tiene esta? Eh, sí, la estaba compartiendo, pero no. Ah, ok. La podía ver ella. Ok, uh -huh. then, go ahead. Dele. Okay. Sure. No sé. Estas no, no me dan la opción. Ok, ahí está. Ahí. Sí, ya la compartí. Ok, and... The other one, está la otra también, right? You took the other one? No, only this. Okay, so remember the other one is can, may, and could. Can, may, and could. Yes, yes, yes it's, it's, it's okay, teacher. Thank you. Okay, let me see. Okay, okay go ahead and continue. Okay, thank you. Okay, no um, you begin uh, uh, I have a, a problem of health if you want you can be the pharmacist uh, it's okay okay
No, aquí está lloviendo. Start again. Okay. Tell me. Where to use a box of the disco clubs? Hello. Hello. Comencemos de nuevo. Okay. Hi, Romulo. May I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something to take? I can hear you. I'm getting a call. Okay. Do you have a call? So, uh, you can say amazing something uh, drops, right? Okay. No. Tengo mala conexión. Okay, I'm right here. I'm listening. Está lloviendo fuerte. Yeah. Okay. También aquí es alguno de ustedes. Hi. Hello. Hi. Elisa. I cannot help you. <laughs> no, me escucha. They don't hear you? No. No? Okay. Eric Enrique. Ella estuvo participando un ratito conmigo, pero después ya se fue. No sé. Y Mariano creo que no le funciona el micrófono. Okay. Then I'm going to put you in another group. Okay. Or you can practice with me. Okay? Okay. All right, great. You are pharmacist and my client. Yeah? Uh, you're uh, the client. The client. Client. Yes, okay. the client. Okay, at least. Okay. okay. I'm, I have a stomach ache. Oh. Uh, what is your suggestion? Okay. Well, I suggest <laughs> you take this this powder medicine okay powder powder and polvo and polvo right powder uh, medicine and they come in little bags of tin uh, uh, i i don't take uh i don't take the medicine i have a peptobismol <laughs> okay, you have Pepto Bismol, right? Okay, okay. <laughs> we have we have Pepto Bismol also. Okay, you can take okay. that, and it comes in mint flavor. Mint flavor. What's the meaning of flavor? Sabor. Oh, okay. okay. Flavor. Okay. Flavor, and I'm okay. going. Okay, I take uh, one bottle, please. <laughs> okay, very good. I'm going to write it for you. Okay, flavor, flavor. Oh. So if you ever want to, for example, outside of this activity, if you ever go eat an ice cream, right? And I ask you, Elizabeth, I'm going to invite you an ice cream. What flavor do you want? Okay. Sabor quiere, right? Strong. Uh, chocolate. My, my favorite flavor is uh, strawberry. All right, yep. very good, yes. Mm -hmm. So now you know flavor, flavor. Flavor. Yes. Okay. Sabor. Okay, great, great, awesome, awesome. Okay, I hope you feel better. I hope you feel better. Okay, thank you. Have a great day. <laughs> All right. <laughs> thank you. Okay, let me see. Let me, we're going back to the main session.
okay? Because it's almost time. We're okay. Okay. The show no hablo nada. Let me see. No okay, hello nada. everyone. Welcome back. Hello. Okay, now I hope hello. you practice and remember there is a difference between just writing and reading, right? Hay una diferencia no más leer y escribir, right? Or or try to see the vocabulary, right? Whereas speaking, speaking. It's what we have to focus on also, okay? You have to practice your speaking. So very good for you that are practicing the speaking in breakout rooms. We will continue tomorrow. I know for some teacher. of you it's raining. Teacher, teacher. Yes, Roberto. Uh, I have problems some days with connect after 9 p.m. for my work. Okay, no problem. All right, no problem. I understand the class ends at nine. So the extra minutes, no, yeah. oh, oh, oh. Only days. Okay, no problem. All right, thank you for telling me. All right. As long as you stay all the way to nine, till nine, you're good. All right. hasta las nueve, you're good. Okay, anything extra is it's just extra. Okay, just extra practice. Well, thank you okay, everyone, thanks. and I see you tomorrow, and we will continue. We will continue. Okay. Have a great day. Have a great night, I mean, right? Yo aprendí la hora, yo. So, take care. Good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. Thank you, thank you. Good night. 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 Remember, la sección 3 en la plataforma, el examen, ya está resuelto eso. Ya está resuelto. So, no inconveniences. Okay? Thank you. Okay. Midterm. Me refiero al midterm. Al midterm. Okay? Okay. Okay. Bye bye. bye. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Have a good tomorrow. Bye bye. 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 bye.